Sizzled with excitement today as the fast food restaurant Roosters crewed its arrival with a grand opening at the Adventure Micro Mall. This new addition to the community birthed from the innovative thinking of the Guy family is poised to make a positive impact on the island. For more on this latest development, return to reporter Luke James Strim. The village of Plymouth welcomed a new addition to its culinary scene, Roosters, a Tobago-based fast food restaurant. This exciting development was the result of a collaborative effort between local businessmen Nevon Guy, Samuel Guy, and Kino Guy, owners of Grobertig Investments, and Jeffrey Azar, the owner of Roosters. According to Azar, the opportunity to partner with these local businessmen was an easy decision. Mr. Samuel Guy came to me a couple of years ago. He said, sir, I want to have your product in Plymouth. I did not even hesitate. I came right away to see the place, and now it's reached its fruitation. He hailed the new addition to the village as a significant milestone for Tobago, the Guy family, and most importantly, the Plymouth community. Chief Secretary Farley Chavez Augustine attended the opening and commended the family-oriented business strategy. It isn't every day that you see family is able to do business together for so long. So it means that you and the Guy family have a secret that you have to share with the rest of Tobago. Because sometimes family try to do business and it doesn't work out. But whenever family does business together well, it tends to last for a very long time. Speaking with Tobago Updates, the Guy family expressed their enthusiasm about bringing roosters to Plymouth. They were particularly drawn to the restaurant's local focus, seeing it as a step forward in supporting Tobago-owned businesses. They believe that this collaboration paves the way for more Tobagonian businesses to enter the market on a regional scale. According to the Guy family, the addition of Roosters not only diversifies Plymouth's culinary offerings, but also fosters a sense of community pride. They envision further collaborations with local vendors, creating a self-sustaining ecosystem for the restaurant and boosting employment opportunities within the village. They envision further collaborations with local vendors, creating a self-sustaining ecosystem for the restaurant and boosting employment opportunities within the village. Luke James Strim, Tobago Updates Television News.